to almost make it like a four-on-four -four game because you can't leave him. Uh, he's got you know decent si decent length for his size. Uh, was encouraged that he was there when we were picking. Larry Drew said you guys were just real excited about this guy from pre-draft camp. What did you see in this guy in tangible wise that really put him high on your list? Kid plays hard, really tries to compete on both ends, and he can shoot. And shooting is a big part of the game. Um, you know, having a guy out there that will space the court for our core group, I think will make the whole, thing, the whole team function better when he's out on the court. You said you were looking for guys who could come in and play immediately. Obviously, you believe this is one of those guys who can like come in and immediately fit into your rotation. Got six guys under contract. Um, now we have rights to eight. Um, you know, we're going to need guys that, that can come in and contribute, uh, guys in a, that, that can add something. Uh, certainly, um, when Coach Drew's looking down the bench, he's trying to, you know, why would I put this guy in? Well, for Jenkins, you know, you put him in because he can knock down shots. I think Mike Scott's experience, his ability to score, his ability to rebound, um, I think was a good value when we were picking. How do you think uh, Jenkins will be able to handle defensively at this level with his uh, <coughs> uh, He cares. And if we have a good system with him where we play together as, you know, five-man five man defense, I think, he can, I think he can do a good job. I think he'll play smart. I think he'll compete every play. Um, and again, You'll have to you have to go down the other end and chase him around. He's he's a dangerous weapon on the offensive end. How much time did you spend with Jenkins interviewing him? Uh, he would. We've had him in a couple times. Uh, I wasn't here for the first time. I was here for the second, and uh, really liked him. And he you know he really wanted to come to Atlanta, which is great. It's not why we picked him, <laughs> um, but uh, certainly he was excited excited to be here. And uh, again, having a guy that's going to space the court for us and really compete on both ends and try to play the right way, uh, I think his experience um, for both he and Scott were, were valuable. For you know, we we have to build a ro we have to build a roster for this year, and I think it's two guys that can then very very possibly contribute. Where do you think Mike Scott fits position wise? He's kind of a tweener in height. Do you think he's a three or a four in the league? Well, Mike Scott's a four. I think he he's 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 got the strength. To be able to play the, the four position, I think he'll be a good player in being able to finish. He's, I think he's a good 16-foot pick and pop type mm -hmm. player that can also finish around the basket and rebound. So I think he's got a chance to be a good player. He's going to have to come in, compete on both ends of the court, defend, follow what Coach Drew is trying to do, and if so, you know, maybe, hopefully he'll be able to earn some some quality minutes. Obviously, it's a small window of opportunity since Monday. So when was John in that, that you were here for the? Uh, John was in Tuesday. Tuesday, or Tuesday, Tuesday. Tuesday. yeah. yeah. Wednesday. You know, it's it's been uh, it's been a fast and furious four days for me, uh, <laughs> as far as uh, um, getting acclimated to what's going on, uh, getting to know the people here better, uh, watching the process that's going on here. Um, you know, again, I think the, uh, our scouts and Rick were very well prepared um, and did a nice job in, in getting thing, things organized. Uh, as we got ready for this draft. Have you uh, had a chance to talk to all the players that you have under contract? I have reached out to all of them, uh, whether talk to them or texting them, and we'll start to try to get together with them coming up here. Penny, how much of these two draft picks is a philosophical match as well in terms of more than just talent, but that they match up to the philosophy of how this team wants to play and how you want them to play? Well, I think you want guys with fiber. And clearly Jenkins, for example, has that. Um, you know, he'll come in and compete every game. He'll, he, you know, I talked to him. He goes, oh, he's going to go to the gym tonight and, sh and shoot around just to celebrate. Yeah. So a guy that loves a guy that loves the hoop is always good to have on your team. But uh, you know, philosophically, I think you know having Jenkins, we want to be a team that, that defends, plays unselfishly, and can shoot the ball. And I think uh, um, adding Jenkins in particular really helps us with that. And again. Um, Mike Scott, uh, when we were picking, I think was a good value in being able to rebound, being able to score, um, you know, having some experience, doing it at the highest level uh, of college. Uh, you know, I think it was a good value, and I'm looking forward to seeing him get after it and really earn, earn the opportunity that's in front of him.